And we're back here in Demon Souls. I am gonna go back to some old areas and see what I can find. I'm gonna start at the beginning with Bulletarian Palace. There's an item there. Huh, there's an item way over there that I have not gotten yet. Oh, here's how we got. There's, there's a, there's a missing piece of the wall. I guess we just jump down and get it. A light crossbow and 16 wooden bolts. Okay. And there's a whole other area here? Oh, yes. This is where that guy... Was, uh, throwing things at us. Huh. Okay. We're back here where that red-eyed knight was that killed us many times. I think we're ready to take this guy on. Or maybe not. A back snap. Wow, he's still... Man, he still does a lot of damage. Oh, we got a good backstab on him. Let's heal while we have a chance. Oh, I did a guard break for some weird reason. Oh, no. And he healed. We got two good hits on him and he's down. What does he drop for us? Full moon grass. Really? That's it? I read that he dropped like a purple fire resistance shield. And we didn't get that. Now this door I assumed was locked, and it is indeed locked. <laughs> okay, well, there we go. Is the dragon not going to come back? Does the dragon not... I don't hear the dragon. Hmm. I don't think the dragon's going to be, uh, making an appearance here. Well, that's kind of a bummer. Does that mean I have to just run up with the, the dragon in full view? Get those items? I guess it does. Let's see what happens. We will probably be burned to a crisp, is probably what's gonna happen. Oh! Yes. Yes, it does seem that that is what's going to happen. <laughs> Getting burned to a crisp. How many more shots will it take to get this dragon? Many more. He's almost done. After almost 30 minutes. We got him! We got him finally! 7,630 souls and a small flame scale demon soul number one. Wow, I've been standing here for so long, plucking away at him with arrows, and he is finally done. Oh, man. How incredibly boring was that? <laughs> All right, we are back here and there is only one dragon now. After so long, we've cleared out this space. No dragons breathing fire on us. Five full moon grasses, that's... Kind of worthless. What else do we have here? A purple flame shield! That's exactly what I wanted! Renowned Soldier's Soul. Renowned Soldier's Soul. Ring of Flame Resistance. I already have... Holy crap! Okay, can I get up and roll away, please? <laughs> I was not expecting that to happen. <laughs> holy crap! 
Okay. So the tail is dangerous. I see now. Okay. Oh, bloody hell. I, why did I not pick up the item? I don't know what that was. I don't know what I just picked up. I have no idea what I just picked up. I'm gonna have to go to a wiki to find out what I just picked up because I have no idea what it was. So we picked up a purple flame shield, which is an old large shield painted in vivid purple. It's quite heavy and very effective against flame attacks. The origin of its characteristic design is unknown. This equipment holds many mysteries. It requires 22 strength. I do not have 22 strength. That makes it somewhat less useful for my purposes. Its effectiveness in battle will be lessened. Great. So I guess I know, uh, I guess I know what I'm gonna do with my, my points now. So apparently the thing that I picked up from the dragon area was a ring of great strength, which raises maximum equip burden. A ring given to King Alot's twin fangs raises maximum equip burden. With this great power, the twin fang Bior wielded a massive steel shield, a large crossbow, and a huge sword with ease. How much does it increase our equip burden? I wonder. We are going back to the Stone Fang Tunnel. Oh, here's an item that I missed. Ah! Uh, it's a... It's a flame lizard. What is this item that I missed? A shard of meltstone. Well, it's not terribly useful to me, but I'll take it. I'll take that and run away. <laughs> I can't even hit this one. Oh, he dropped something. Holy crap, he dropped a shard of sharp stone, four of them, and a large sharp stone shard, and two shards of clear stone. I guess he was carrying all that in his sack. <laughs> that was funny. So just for the record, this is where that ring of poison resistance was. It was hiding over here in the corner, and I just walked right past it. I'm just gonna jump right down here. Get yeah, one of them at least. There's one. A large... Oh, we can't pick it up! Seriously? Oh, man. Alright, so we gotta put on a ring, I guess. Um... Herculean strength, I guess. Is that the one we want? Yeah, I need that chunk of hard stone, man. I need the hard stone. I can't. Ah, oh, God. I knew that was gonna happen. I just, I saw it coming a mile away, and I just, I just did it anyway. I just walked right into it. Like, hey, please, camera, fling me off the side of the, the cliff. Any crystal lizards? Where are they? They're all gone. What the hell? There was like a million of them. Now there's none. Do they just, do they disappear forever? That sucks. There has to be a way to jump over to that.
and we just jump from here? That's just a crazy long jump. Oh my god, I did it! Oh my god, what a crazy long jump. Clear stone and sharp stone. Seriously, that's what I got for that crazy lucky jump. Okay, so there is something down below us. Below, below us. Let's put on the cling ring. Let's heal up. Is that too far down though? God, it looks like too far down. Oh man. But how do we get to that item right there though? Oh, I didn't run. It's okay. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. So we can jump down here, right? Yeah. Here's another item. Ring of disease resistance. Yes. We did it. We've accomplished the impossible. Wait, haven't I... I feel like I could have gotten that several times. Oh uh, yeah, okay, that was great. Good job. Bam! Good. Oh god, I keep forgetting to they explode. <laughs> he didn't drop anything. Oh, you bastard. One more. He's down. All right. Now there's an item right there. Can we get it without dying? Pick up item. Chart of Dragonstone. Oh! God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, we died. We died for that Dragonstone. Alright, we're getting there. Alright, now there's probably some like, uh... Oh, maybe not. All right, so now let's put on the fire resistance ring. Woo! <laughs> that does a lot of damage. Yes, it does. Oh, we got that one without taking damage. Nice! You guys drop anything cool? It's not. Alright, so there's clearly an item way down there. Oh, we can actually... We can actually move along the wall here. Can't we? Yes, we can. What? Oh, I thought I used a spice thing. I guess, guess I didn't. Oh, there's another tunnel in here. 
Though we clearly can't get to that item. That would just be suicide to try to get to that. Yeah, there's there's no way we're going to get to those items. That's just suicide. Right? It is definitely suicide, right? Definitely suicide. So there's one more guy over here. Keep an eye on our health. Alright, that guy's coming after us. Alright, let's go in this cave. What is in this cave? The secret cave. I feel like I've been here before, though. There's an item. Oh, this is that item we were looking at all that time across the way. What is it? An unknown hero soul. Wow. That's not really worth that much. But at least we know what it is. Um... Okay, now the question is, how do we get out of here? Oh, there's an item. It's an item we've missed. A chunk of clear stone. Nice. When that thing explodes, it's going to explode very big. I had to... I looked around to make sure I had a way out. Man, these bear bug tunnels. Dragonstone! I didn't even have to risk death for that one. There we go. Here we go. This is, this is how we get out of here. Oh yes. We just had to kill that one. Right? Right? Surely, there's a torch. That's gotta be leading to some place we want to go. Right? Aha! Ah! Go away. Go away, you bastards. Go away. Yes! Alright, let's go back to the Tower of Latria because there are things that I have missed. Oh! Expletive deleted. Okay, this could be a problem. Because we're dead. Alright, I have come back here to the Tower of Latria to Sage Freak's cell because I think I have the key for this cell now. Perhaps you could help me get out of here. I am a sage, and I can lend you my power in return. Oh, take heed of those octopus-headed guards. Yes, I know all about them. I'm going to attempt to open your cell now. Yes, I used the special key. Hello there, Mr. Freak. Magnificent. I never expected to get out of there alive. My name is Freak. I am known as a sage. I thought my magic would give me an edge against these demons, but how wrong I was. I have been enfeebled by my long imprisonment, but I can still move my legs, and I can make it back to the Nexus. I thank the stars that I escaped when I did. I owe you my life. Hey, Gary Stiletto. Thank you. 
I have been enfeebled by my long imprisonment, but I... Okay, so he's heading back to the Nexus, I guess. Can I do anything with this? I don't... I don't know if I want to touch it. I don't want to touch it, because it might kill me instantly. So, Gary's stiletto is a thrusting weapon, piercing weapon. An extremely small rapier, dagger-sized and bladeless, it is imbued with special magic. It was made by Gary, a friend of Sage Freak, the visionary, who is known for his magical crafts. It steals a small amount of mana from its targets. Interesting. Is it also... has a magical attack? Huh, doesn't have very much requirements. That's interesting. Okay, so we rescued Sage Freak. Yay us. Oh, Jesus. That hurt. And there went another eyes. All right, there is a, uh, there is an item down here. But once we get it, I kind of feel like we have to die to get it. Because I don't see any way back. Oh! Bloody hell, cannot carry it. What is it? Give it to me! Stone of ephemeral eyes, really? Really? Whoa! Okay, we got up on here. Can we get anywhere from here? Oh, we can get back here. Awesome. Aha! All right, we learned something. But now, can we get, oh, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, we're gonna get it now, we're gonna get this item now, and it is the Mercury Rapier, plus one, that's a poison rapier, I believe. Can we get back up this way? No, nope, I think we need to go back down. And then up here. Yeah, there we go. Awesome. Hey, have you seen Sage Freak? You saved Sage Freak, did you not? Then I was right to bend the rules and teach you a few tricks. Nevertheless, I'm grateful to you. Do you see how important selfless acts are in this dreary world? Sure. What is it? Are you still begging for magic lessons? Ah, oh, so be it. Better than having you bother Sage Freak. Uh... What other spells do you have? Flame Toss. Shoots a stream of fire. Wow, it doesn't use a very much... ...mana, either. I think I'm just gonna buy that. I'm gonna buy that. I might actually, uh, I might switch from Soul Arrow to Flame Toss. No, actually I'm not, because Soul Arrow uses less mana. Be careful how you use it. Okay, I will. I will, I will. Hey, Sage Freak, what's up? How are you liking the new place? Hmm. I have a proposal for you. Could you bring your demon souls to me? As I determine more about the essence of the soul, I can teach you new magic. A demon soul is no mere amalgamation of lesser souls. You have your wits about you. Surely you understand me? Sure. What, uh, what are you talking about? 
Soul Ray. Oh, nice. It fires a ray of light which pierces the target. The idol from which this spell was derived was in the form of the Queen of Now Lost Latria. This spell shows a fraction of the Queen's power as a gifted sorceress. Huh. So we bring in uh, Demon Souls and it will give us... He'll, uh, he'll give us some uh, magic spells. That's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Do you have a connection to the disciples? Do not pay attention to them if they speak poorly of me and my magic. Prayer is for the foolish, quaint, and soon to be dead. And heaven forbid the day you find out what their so-called god really is. Well, that sounds ominous. I was defeated and captured by the Golden Elder beyond that dungeon. Beware of him, for he manipulates souls. He has power over dark souls, those susceptible to madness and paranoia. That sounds even more ominous. I know of three human leaders who became demons. King Alant of Boletaria, Astraea of the Valley of Defilement, and the Golden Elder of Latria. They have proven that humans can evolve to a higher state. We were wrong to assume that only demons could do demon work. I don't remember making that assumption. He has power over dark souls, those susceptible to madness and paranoia. Who does? We were wrong to assume that only demons could do demon work. Who are you talking about? Eh, okay, whatever. I am fully prepared. Please fetch more demon souls. I can still be patient, my fine magician friend. Okay. I will do that. Now let's make our way to the Fool's Idol Archstone in the Tower of Latria. Okay, I don't want to be... Oh, we're dead. Okay. Well, that was... That was unfortunate. Holy hell. That guy just one-shot me. There's definitely an item right there. So I'm thinking we need to go back down these stairs and back around. Or else jump down? Can we jump down from here? Sure, we can jump down from here. Just walk off the edge. Right? Oh, God, that was close. That was really close. I thought I was going to fall off the edge. A rune sword and a rune shield. Oh, yeah, that sounds cool. I don't know what they are, but let's check them out. The rune shield is uh requires 18 magic so i guess we're not using that an exquisitely crafted golden shield strongly enhanced with magic it protects the user from magical attacks it is the shield of the legendary hero who used it with its matching rune sword it does look a lot like the uh the shield of astrava and the rune sword appears to be appears to do regular and piercing damage and magical damage requires 18 magic i don't have that an exquisitely crafted golden sword its physical attack power is negligible but it is enhanced with powerful spells and protects its wielder from magic it is a legendary hero's weapon that forms a matching set with the rune shield Interesting. 
Interesting. Now how do we get out of here? How do we get off of this ledge? I can't help but wonder that. Uh, that looks like a long drop to my death. Oh, I bet we can jump down here. Here we go, we can jump down here. Anything else around here? Doesn't look like it. I guess we'll just jump down. Call it a win. We got the rune stuff. All right, here we are overlooking this spot where those prism stones and there's an item. I think we can just drop down here and get to them. Question is, can we get back up again? And the item is a shard of arch stone. Oh, there's somebody in a cage over here. Hello? Who are you? Are you here to fight the demons? If so, then help me escape this place. I am on your side. I have come to face the demons. Uh, do I want to open the jail cell? And also, I feel like my left earbud has gone out. Um... Yeah, he sounds... he sounds nice. Okay, where are you going? Thank you. I will remember this. I am certain we will meet again. Okay... You... <laughs> Your weaponry reminds me quite a lot of Lotric from Dark Souls, which is not a good thing. Uh, can you perhaps tell me how to get out of here? Can you tell me the way uh, down from here? Do I have to use your jail cell to get out of here? Yeah, I have a feeling we're going to have to fight this guy sometime in the future. I'm almost certain. This this must be an elevator, right? This is going to take me down to the swamps. Let's see where it takes us. I'll bring your jail cell back someday. Maybe. Or maybe not. Maybe we'll see him up in the Nexus. Okay, we're down here in the swamp. Just where we wanted to be. Oh god, that one just jumped on me. Heal. Oh, that's not healing. That's not healing. Okay, get away, get away, get away. That's not healing. Heal. Okay, I'd like to heal, if it's okay. Can I heal, please? No, I can't, and I died. Great. Fantastic. I don't get to heal, I don't get to block, I don't get to do anything. Oh, Jesus! Holy... What the... What in the holy hell is that? It's red. That's what it is. It's got a lot of hit points. It's it's doing bad things. I don't like this one. Why is this one attacking me like this? Why are you doing this to me? Oh, stamina. Where did this thing come from? that. I don't have much room to back up anymore. Is he dead? I think he might be dead. He's dead. He dropped something. It's yellow. It's a shard of mercury stone. Not what I wanted, but cool nevertheless. Where the heck am I? I don't think I'm where I thought I was. I thought I was in the, uh, the same place 
where I came down from the other, other elevator, but I think it might be different. There's a squiggly tail right there, making me nervous. Let's wait for it to go fast again, because it's going to come down and squish me, isn't it? Oh, Jesus, there's a bunch of them. Okay, let's, let's run away. Oh, God. Move tail, move tail. Let's try to get these guys from a distance. I don't want to get that close to them. Oh, God, I hit the tail. Don't kill me, big tail, please. Please don't kill me. I mean you no harm. It was just an accident that I hit you. I don't think I can get that one. Oh, here comes the tail. Wait for the tail to move. There is an item over there. I mean, I can barely hear any sound right now. I don't know where my sound went. All right, got him. Who else is... Oh, what is that? What the heck is that? I don't want to be near that. I feel like I want to um, shoot that from a distance as well. <laughs> if you don't mind. I'm just going to shoot that from here. I don't know what it is. It doesn't... A lot of... I mean, it doesn't have a lot of hit points. Is it an actual... Can I talk to you or something? Wow, that made a lot of noise. Colorless demon soul. That was a colorless demon? Was I supposed to talk to that? <laughs> a ring of disease resistance. Nice. I think I already have one of those, don't I? Alright. Is that all of them except for that red one? Why is there a red one here? I guess it's because... I mean, I guess it's because we uh, killed the big guy and he dropped some red dudes down here. Red face centipede spiders. Alright, get your get your red poison away from me, whatever that is. Another hit. One more. Yep, we got him. And he dropped something good. A shard of mercury stone. Two shards of mercury stone. Awesome. The question is, can we get him from a distance? And the answer is, I don't think so. Yes, we can, actually. Oh, God. Look out. Look out. He killed in, in one shot. He one shot me. Oh, my God. Oh, I'm so stupid. Wait, did I see an... There is an item over here. Oh, there's an item over there, too. Can we get these items without getting killed? A fragrant ring? What is a fragrant ring? I don't know. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's get our good weapon out here. Can we can we just shoot that guy from a distance? I feel like that's that's the play here. I just want to shoot this guy from a distance. I am not going to stress about this. I don't want to 
I don't want to deal with that guy. I am out of arrows. Well, I guess we're going to deal with that guy then. Back. Alright, wait for him to go back into his, his ball form. One stab and then get away. We are not taking chances here with so many souls on the line and not even really knowing where I am or where I'm going. Okay, I did take a chance there and did two hits. That was a tremendous mistake because this guy could kill me in like one, if he catches me in those, those swings. Oh, here's my cat. This is a terrible time for you to be here, cat. Okay, the cat has been thrown out of the room. Now, let's get this guy. I think we just need one more hit on him and he's done, right? One more hit. Yes. We got him and he was protecting all these items. What are they? A shard of mercury stone, two. And two more shards of mercury stone. That's what you were protecting, huh? Mercury stone. Okay, here's an item over here. Next to this suspicious tendril. A chunk of mercury stone. So we can make all kinds of poison items now. And this takes us right back to the beginning. Yes, and there is the thing. Let's get up. Let's get out of here. I can't believe we survived. We survived. We're going back to the Nexus. Yes. Strength 22. Boom. Now, we... Let strength be granted so the world might be made. Now we can use that then? shield. Yep, I'm done. We... Sweet. Awesome. We've done it. We've leveled our strength up to 22.